Hey everyone, what is up? It's Everything Ava here, and in today's video, we're going to be showing you how to install or uh, I mean Windows 7 in VirtualBox in 2020. And I'd like to say Happy New Year to everyone because I think it's due. Um, and yeah, so um, now we're gonna open a new machine, um, and we're gonna type. Oh, it already has preset Windows 7. This is the version we're gonna want to do, and we're going to select the right RAM and then we're gonna make a virtual disk so okay so now what we're gonna do is we're gonna go into settings because that's the first thing we have to do um, if you want to if you want to you can enable 3d acceleration and crank this up to full Be if you want to do um, you know um, what do you call it uh, arrow effects um, and we're gonna choose the hot the file Thing, and we're gonna go to my removable disk because that's where I had to store it last and we're gonna open this this is the thing you can find it at softlay.com and we're gonna start the machine I mean if it wants to start it's very flickery right now mm, it's working I'm gonna full screen this just so you guys can see better. And so it's gonna start loading all the files, and um, in case you didn't know, this is coming from my USB flash drive, so um, it's uh, it's probably gonna be very slow, especially because I plugged it into my um, USB two port, or it might even actually be USB one. I'm not even sure. If it is USB 1, I'll be damned. Because USB 1 would just be terrible. Um, I mean, like if you agree. Like the video, that is. Um, yeah, uh, give a like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I, and for this year, I actually really want to get to 1K subscribers so I can be monetized the year after that. So I'm really hoping you guys can help me accomplish my dream. Um, of being at 1k by the end of the year um, so that means December 2020 I want to be at 1k so seems like it's taken a while so um, I think um, oh hey it's working um, I'll come back to you guys when it actually starts you know like booting and stuff and yeah okay guys so now Windows 7 is about to start so you're just gonna click anything you need to do and it'll click install now so it will say step, set up and starting and I don't think it's going to ask for a product key when we're um, a thing but if it does I'm going to have to find one if I can uh, anyways now I'm hoping it'll let me activate online instead because activate online has been an option since windows vista so hmm. we're going to see when this is coming uh, I will I, I think I'll just stop the video until it's done loading, so, yeah. Okay, now it's asking about the license terms, so you don't actually need to read this, but if you are a, um, married to the law, then you could read this. If you want, this is service pack one, so it's the newest one. Um, and you're gonna click custom if you're installing this new, and then click on the space, and now it's going to be done, so it, it's going to load, and then it'll say that's all the information right now. Will, your computer will restart several times during installation, so when it's done, it's restarting whatever, then we'll come back to you again. Okay guys, so now Windows 7 is ready to use, so now I'm going to type um, the username, so I'm just going to type everything Eve. Oh, it's too long. Anyways, and now you. Okay, um, I'm just gonna call this um, EBPM because technically it is. And I'll just keep it without the thing. Skip this. And it's gonna ask you to help protect your computer. I'll just use recommended settings. It's gonna ask you about the thing, the time zone, so I'm gonna do that. That's the right time. Um, and then you don't want to click home or work network, you want to click public network. 
because then the home network will just keep you stuck on the same thing and you definitely do not want that so I guess it'll finalize the settings and it'll come back when it's starting to boot to the desktop. Alright so now Windows 7 installation is done and as you can see it's got everything here for me ready and so I hope you guys really like this video and if you did maybe comment like and subscribe and I see you all next time. Bye!